Hello, buddy. Okay, so this is the moment we have been waiting for, ladies and gentlemen. Just look at that. Oh boy, just look at that beauty. Okay guys, do you want to see what happens if I use M26 Pershing with one of its stock guns? 76mm M1A2 gun right over here with improved rammer, ventilation, stabilizer, with rammer directive, with food, with brothers in arm skill. What you get is 2.4 second reload time, which is the fastest reload time possible in high tears. Which means I just made the biggest auto loading clip featuring 92 shells with um, <laughs> um, 177 millimeters of penetration, 115 alpha damage. Well, I basically made a never ending auto loading gun with 2.4 second reload time between shots. Let's see how this behaves. And we actually just want the jackpot as well, because we are facing tier 6 tanks, which is the only tier this gun is actually able to penetrate in nowadays world of tanks, so let's see what is going to happen. My goal is to deal at least, uh, let's say, 10 shots worth of damage, which is, um, you know, 1150. <laughs> 1150 damage ladies and gentlemen so let's not set our goals too high and not too hardcore and boom oh boy okay this is funny this can actually be very funny i think we might be able to take two shots into anyone who is crossing that open field up over there there is a skoda at the very back Ooh, almost a hit but almost a hit does not pay the bills honestly speaking Someone is blind shooting my bush right over here. Okay, Centurion. Hopefully a hit. <laughs> critical hit, no damage done. Nothing done, actually. That was a critical hit, but we did absolutely nothing with that. Hello, sir. Guys, we penetrated something. And that might be the only penetration. Never mind. We're bending that guy. Dude, I might have as fast reload time as that uh, Churchill, actually. That is something to think about. They need to pull back a bit. Because we are losing this battle 0 to 7. So we did win the jackpot with uh, the tier 6s, uh, facing tier 6s, but we did not win the jackpot with uh, the, all the rest of the teammates. I would say so. 107 damage in a tier 8 uh, tank, you know, that is actually criminally low. I would say so. It is only a matter of time when those guys are. Going to eat us alive over here. Zero to eight as well. Okay, so my goal was to deal ten shots worth of damage, right? If I remember correctly. Come on. <coughs> Make some moves. Okay, Scorpion. And you. This is very bad. This is actually very bad. So very bad. I can't even one-shot that Scorpion, guys. Can't even do that. Okay. Well, I'm firing fast, at least. I am firing fast, but, you know, I do not have that DPM. And are we going to lose this battle 0 to 15? There is a huge chance that we are actually going to lose this battle 0 to 15. Okay, who ruined it? Hellcat. Oh, you silly Hellcat. 1 to 15. Nice. Next battle. Second battle, well, we did not win jackpot this time, but at least it is not versus tier 9s or tier 10s, which this gun absolutely would hate seeing. Uh, as you saw from the previous battle, it struggled even over there. So let's see, I have no big hopes. Maybe I should have a bit bigger hopes, guys, because that shot was absolutely legendary. 107 legendary damage done right over there at the start of the battle. And I honestly don't know where I want to be actually with this gun. Is it useless? Well, so far it has not proven to be absolutely crazy useful, if we are completely honest over here. Unless I'm able to do something crazy o Wait, what? We had a critical hit, so maybe we damaged the Amorak slightly, and then someone completely blew it off. Uh, okay, I take back. We are going to be very, very useful over here doing little tiny critical damage hits, right? Uh, can we see ISU? Can we... Oh, we might be able to see ISU, actually. So let's knock over this tree very nicely, and ISU right up over there. That is a hit. Okay. All right, guys. All right, all right, all right. Scorpion G still might come back. Let's see. 
That's a miss. But at least we are able to miss super often, guys. We have such a fast reload and we are able to miss so many shots so often. My goal over here, guys, today is actually be in a top 3 damage dealing position. That would be fantastic with this massive 92 shell autoloader. The biggest goal, of course, is to drag someone to give someone on, uh, like, on put and simply hammer them down. That would be the best thing what could happen in today's video, in today's battles. Simply hammering down someone. Okay, nothing over here. Nothing spotted. Oh, hello. Lantern C. Let's try to get an angle on that Lantern, because this is uh, what uh, would be called a pro gamer move, I would say so. If I push down like this, we may spot the Lantern. Oh my god, that snipe, guys. Oh, Lee. Sweet mother of shells. That was beautiful. That was actually beautiful. Hello, anybody home? I would like... I would like to knock on your door 1000 times. And they have entered too as well sniping, so we have to pull back. Did you see how fast they fired over there? Two times? Yeah, I did. Two tap that guy. Where is Panther? Let's go after the Panther 2. Panther 2 was somewhere over here. Let's go after Panther 2. This might be the one versus one fight we have been looking for, guys. Do we have a shot into a shoot? No! Uh, just double barreled. That guy just got double barreled. Hello, Panther. Hello, buddy. Okay, so this is the moment we have been waiting for, ladies and gentlemen. Just look at that. Oh, boy. Just look at that beauty. Just look at that. <laughs> Sir, that rate of fire is definitely going to surprise them. Let me tell you what, guys. I know what was uh, the first thought in that panther's mind. When did Pershing get an autoloading gun? Since today. And even Arnie is showing support towards my crazy build right over here. How far are we with the damage? Okay, we're very, very far away from the top three. I'm actually super sad that Artiller was able to get uh, quite a nasty hit into Panther. We had such a nice, uh, cozy time farming uh, that Panther. And you actually took my position as well because of that uh, damage trade right over there. Um, only 11,000 credits lost. Well, let's go again. And would you look at that? I believe this is going to be the best battle to finish off today's episode with because in the first battle we saw tier 6s, then we saw tier 8s and now tier 7s and 9s, so we have seen everything but tier 10 and this is, in my opinion, mission accomplished because I don't want to see tier 10s. No, 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 not with this gun right over here. And uh, I am going to do something maybe a bit uh, aggressive on the aggressive side, but oh, hello, ladies and gentlemen, are you ready for this absolute carnage? What is about to happen into this uh, Scorpion G? And just before you're able to get away, boom, I was not able to hit my shot and only all that because I missed my second or actually my first shot into Scorpion G. That was very, very sad, but this guy did not spot me back for some odd reasons. Okay, here is Panther, who spotted me back as well, most definitely. Yes, you did. Is uh, Scorpion going to peek? And never mind, Scorpion has been destroyed. They have uh, one tier 9 tank destroyer as well, which uh, is a bit worrisome. I don't know where that guy is going to be, has not been spotted yet. So, could be up over there, could be sniping. Tier is SU. Ooh, hello SU. Hello SU. This guy as well is asking, what is that? Since when did Pershing get autoloading gun? <laughs> and I think this is the best feature of this tank with this gun, this surprise factor. They don't want to fight with it because they don't know when the shells are going to run out. Well, I can tell you exactly when I run out of shells. After firing 86 more times, we have IS-2M pushing in aggressively, which is uh, weird but awesome at the same time. Let's destroy this. But now... Let's try to punish this guy. Okay. Guys, I can keep him tracked, don't you worry. I can keep him tracked. Even though I'm not able to penetrate even the lower plate of that guy. Oh, oh, he might be able to do that. Don't block it! 
Don't block my shot. Look at this rate of fire. And I just got to kill as well. I just got to kill as well, guys. What more can I ask? Actually, what more can I ask from this battle already? 6 to 1 winning this after that absolutely horrible, horrific first battle. We are bringing stuff back. Okay, let's see how many shots. 1, 2. Someone else dragged him. Someone else just got the drag. Yeah, someone just stole the dragging from me. Never mind. Now it's my dragging. And uh, don't kill me, don't kill me, please. Okay, thank you. Now let's try to flank someone. They have some heavy tanks left in the city. Let's go. We have to go for the flank. Oh, yes, we have to go for the flank. We are like assisting, assisting guys over here. We're more, we are doing more assistance than anything. I think this lad just took the shot, guys. I think this lad, oh, again. When did Pershing get out the loading gun? Is the first question. How many shots do we need to get for Drax? What? <laughs> what is happening in this game? Oh, look at that, guys. Oh my god, look at this rate of fire just now. Oh my god, what is this carnage? Absolute carnage. 4,800 damage done. Ladies and gentlemen, this was, or this is... The biggest auto loading clip in the game on Pershing. The fastest possible reload time in high tiers, 2.4 seconds, 92 shells in total. We can call it infinite auto loader. Definitely can do that. How far are we in the damage board? Arnie supporting it once again. Thank you very much. Let's apply some of that. Oh, first class. I can't ask for more. And I finished top three by damage done. And second by experience because of assistance. Ladies and gentlemen, if you have some more ideas, let me know in the comment section down below. I'm out.